generic greetings and welcome back once again to Railroad. It's been a while, hasn't it? By the way, today's beverage is a very nice coffee, black, no sugar, also exceptionally hot pain. So welcome back to Railroads. It has been a while. The other day I was browsing through the Steam list and realised, to my abject horror I should add, that Railroads was just not installed and that's because I've semi-recently got a new rig, generic computational machine version 3, and well, I just forgot to reinstall it. I thought there was a gaping void in the universe somewhere. Uh, so either way, reinstalled and well, let's play some of this. Let's go to single player here. I'm going to go to Germany because it's a map we don't often play on. Medium difficulty, normal routing and all of that, AI plays 3, and let's see what it gives us. We're going to go with a almost a bit of an arbitrary challenge. We're going to go with the sausage train challenge, which basically means that all trains have to be have to be the maximum uh, number of cars long, which is eight. I think we have done this challenge in the past, but to my knowledge, not on this map. We've already got people to our north. We've got Helmuth von uh, Malt, I think, and they're in Leipzig. We've got in Dresden here, San Nicholas the second, and where is our arch nemesis Dresden? Where are they? Uh, not in Weiss, uh, Klangfurt, we've got Bosen, uh, Lichtenstein, Bern, Schausberg, ah, Frankfurt, okay, that's where they are then. So what I'm hearing is, we are, we are the most southern person on the map, I believe so, and Munich, we can turn steel into cars, and my or oh mine, there is two mines very far south, right, let's get this going. Unpause, max speed, single track, from Munich, right over to here. And the reason for that is, we're double tracking it. Straight away, we're going to go big or go home. We may be going home soon enough. But, the reason for this is, we want passengers and mail. But because we have to max them out, we can't do our usual, which is, three passengers and two mail. We have to max it out. So, passengers and mail on the go. Job done. Right, triple track. Sell some shares first. Triple track. Triple track is now going to go all the way down here. Selling some shares. Winding through the valleys into Klangenfurt, which we will put after selling some more shares. A station. Mayor of New Nuremberg says so it's railway. Good for you. You're not getting one. Uh, <laughs> sounds a bit harsh, but yes, we are not bothered about that at this stage. So, oh, new speed record. It is Bismarck. Bismarck. Uh, 26 miles an hour. Well done to them. Fair player and all that, I guess. So, we're going to max out the ore. Wait until full. Go there. Clear it. So we can have full or nothing. Oh, Sir Nicholas II. 32 miles an hour on untested technology in 1837. I say untested, newish technology. I wouldn't like to go at that speed. Um, okay, we're gonna do. We're gonna do it. We're gonna buy out the steel mill. So, this is where Bismarck jumps in. No, it's uh, Helmuth there. So, what we're doing is we're buying out the steel mill, knowing for a fact that it's gonna make a lot of money because we've got uh, two of these very close. I'm just hoping we've got the money. We have got some shares to, share, uh, to sell. So I paid a little more than I wanted, 208,000. But that's okay because, like I said, that's going to pay us back in absolutely no time. Because we can have now another train going from there. Max that out. Go to there. Wait until full. Go there. Clear the car. And come back. So that is now working well. What we're going to do is upgrade this to a station and then to a terminal to get more unload speed as well as, uh, probably one of the most important, um, extra mail revenue, passengers and mail. We're going to do a similar thing to... Oh, no, we're not. You know what we're going to do? We're going to visit Vienna. Straight across. Get a track in there. Once again, double track. Sell the last remaining share. And... Cross this. You can't do the cr the cross, and I, people do keep reminding me of what it's called. There is a proper name for that uh, type of switch, but 
can't remember it. Anyway, uh, half cost to build tunnels. Don't plan on doing that, so we're not going to bother. So passengers and mail. There we go. Passengers and mail. It may be of some benefit to triple track this. And then put that into there. Ooh, no, no, no. Always build from the existing track to the ends. It just works better. We'll do that. Okay. So, that, there's another loco. I didn't see what it was, but it was another loco. Anyway, um, we're going to upgrade this to a terminal. We're going to upgrade that to a station and then a terminal. And we're going to alter that. So, after it's gone there, we're maxing out on... Sorry, maxing out on steel. Wait until full. Oh, we can't go there. Can we not? No, we can't. So that needs to cross to there. And furthermore, it needs to do that. Because now, this car, we can alter it. Filling up on steel. Wait until full. Go to there. Clear the car. Come back. Uh, oh, is that right? How can it not? Is that the right one? Come down here, clang and furt, and go up to there. That should work. That should work. So it is from Frankfurt, take all the steel, then go to there, then clear. Yeah, it's probably just a little quirk of what's going on there. So we are definitely bringing steel to there, which means the automobile factory is worthy of our attention. Let's put a bid in that and start buying out our stocks because, quite frankly, we are we are low on stocks. We're also... Are we first? Oh, we're only just first. I was going to say we're very low, but we're actually first. <laughs> and there we go. We're now on that. Excellent. Um, there's a wood company here that we could supply goods straight to Bern. And that would be paper. Uh, I think Berlin traditionally has a newspaper, but it doesn't look to be the case here. So where are we going to transport the the automobiles? I don't think... Is there any desire for automobiles at this stage in the game? Yes, there is. In Berlin. Um, actually, Vienna, I think. Yes, Vienna. So we want to transport... This is going to be an interesting... <laughs> wow, there we go. That's a bit of a track. <laughs> there is a bit of a track. So it's gone from here to here, all the way across. Um, we'll just do some sort of routing, just to give the game a fighting chance. Don't need to do something like this, you understand, but it just helps out at times. And there we go. So from here, from Munich, and I'm waiting for that thing, upgrade. Mm, there's not much in it, but it's slightly faster. Uh, Nuremberg wants swine. Oh, look at that. Double pig farm. Right near there. Can we exploit that or is it a little bit too far? I think it might be a little bit too far for our liking. Hmm. Here's the steel, which is now in. So what we'll do from here, we're going to transport cars to there. I'm not even going to bring anything back. That's just going to do. That's just going to do. So from Vienna, is there anywhere we can go? Is there anywhere, any more steel we can get? Um, there's only other two sources of steel and it's quite a ways away. This does have a... Bozen does have a pig farm though. Which... It's right there. That's actually within our reach, I believe. Let's go ahead and... Actually, I want to double check. Is everyone leveled up? That's leveled up. That's leveled up. That I know is leveled up. Right, what we'll do, we're going to continue on from here through the mountain into Bozen, and then down here into that. So this will be a fairly simple thing. Half cement and cost in all trains. McCoy, lubricate, patent. We definitely want that. We also want to definitely buy out some of our own stock. And we're going to buy Bismarck stock because it's Bismarck. 
There's Nicholas also buying in. We definitely want half maintenance cost. Although we haven't got a lot of trains, actually. But we definitely want to pick it up, which we've now got it. Brilliant. So from there, max out on the swine, clear the car, go back. And the other stuff is over here. I wish I had the half maintenance costs on all trains now, that would have definitely helped us out. But we don't, so no point in crying too much about it. How much would this cost? And I believe that is, if we would do that, that would be the biggest tunnel I've ever made in the game. It has to be, it has to come close. It's over half a million. And how about 500% return on investment? That's a, let's have a look. Oh, huh. that is, huh. get a good net worth of uh, 500,000. Right, so this is going to be one of those <laughs> weird, um, weird setups. <laughs> oh, that's, I actually think that's really interesting. Sadly, we don't, there's no such thing as passing points in the game, as far as I'm aware. I've played it long enough, I should probably know, but no, I've not not really got on with anything like that. But what we're doing is basically we're taking all of the pigs, but sadly they're just going to have to queue up, and it's going to take a while. It is going to take a while, but it is what it is. Um, and now here, though, we're going to have a decent amount of food that we can carry over. So the question is, do we want to do that? I mean, the answer is yes. But how are we going to do it? We're going to have to alter the... We're going to have to alter things here. So from here, we're going to go to... That's a weird one. Ah, oh, darn it. Bad steel stings local steel industry. Brilliant. When I mean brilliant, I mean not brilliant. Uh, the 240 Medic. Very nice. We may go ahead and change things on our railway. Uh, what I'm going to do is, from here, I'm going to... I'm going to have to sort of bring this around and I'll double I'll triple tracker here and the idea is that we can go from there to there and this one and oh, we didn't actually get the I think we've messed it up yeah the stockyard should have bought the stockyard a long time ago oh and I've just sold chairs as well right calm down all thrust no vector is not a good idea so what I'm going to do is buy this out, and I've got the stockyard, interesting, didn't think we'd get that for such a low price. So we're going to go there, then we're going to max out on food, wait until full, go there, clear the car, job done. We will get that to a station, then a terminal, and because I can, we're going to keep buying out Bismarck. I think we're going to buy out Bismarck and liquidate him. Mainly because of our hatred for for the fellow in the game. <laughs> if, you, if you don't know, <laughs> uh, previously we were... It's been Bismarck for some reason. It's <laughs> used to play multiplayer and um, it was always Bismarck that really got your goat. It was just, yeah, often you'd be trying to do something and Bismarck just seemed to pop up. Or like run rings around you. Anyway, we have... Look at that. That's our tra uh, our train car. Car. Yeah. Um, upgrading. Oh, it's much better for freight. And look at it go. Let's go ahead and upgrade all these things. I think some of them are already upgraded. Hmm. And I'm going to keep buying out Bismarck stock. Don't think I'll be able to liquidate him in one go. But it is potentially a thing. Um, we need to continue building. One of the things you have to do in the game is you need to keep going. If you stop... Ooh. Bonus money for perishables. We have perishables. So we're going to make sure we get that. While still buying out Bismarck. <laughs> Uh, right. Hmm. Gonna have to sell some shares to afford it. We definitely want it. Put an extra bid on it as well. I 
think we're going to get it for just shy of 200,000. That's fine. Okay, over here we have this line. And... Could go all the way to Rotterdam, I guess. And liquidate Bismarck. Wow. I don't think... Well, it's been a long time since we've played the game in any measure, but I don't think we've uh, been able to buy someone out that quick, that early in the game. Uh, what we're doing here is we're going all the way to Rotterdam and buying out, preemptively, we're buying out their brewery. And immediately we've got Helmuth jumping in. Cologne's not really of interest to us because it's power plant. It's just going to... Yeah, it's pointless. It's turning ore into nothing. <laughs> well, into money, basically, if you own it. Whereas we've got all of the production line going. Ore to steel, steel to cars, cars to the owner. In short time. Industry done. Bought out. Let's uh, keep buying some shares. I'm actually going to put it to normal speed now. For the time being. Um, so from here, we want to go for all the grain to there, clear the car, job done. Uh, Rotterdam, naturally, will upgrade to a terminal, and we'll see where on earth the nearest grain thing is. Um, over there, but it's getting, it's already getting picked up. So realistically, we just need to get, oh, look at the line from the, into Hamburg there. Nothing's getting taken there, because, well, we can see where the old train track used to be. <laughs> Bismarck. Um, there's a paper mill there, and can we take paper from here? Uh, sorry, no, that is a... Yeah, it demands paper. So if we were to generate paper over here, where would we get the paper from? We would have to get... Oh, we'd have to... oh, we could take it down to there. It's actually a lot simpler to go from there along. Uh, we might do that, but eyes on the prize. From here, it's going to curve round. Curve round and head in at Hamburg. And might as well connect those up. And I think that is oh, fancy furniture falls to fill some press. Locals vote with their wallets. So now industry's down. Everything's down. Right, so we'll double track this all the way to here. And I'm not too concerned about the routing per se. I'll do. And want to go for buy some more shares buy a little bit of shares in Nicholas goes to there that's been upgraded so we want to transport from here passengers because we can whereas this one with the weird floating fields <laughs> Okay, we have high technology. Um, this one is going to go to here. It's going to gather the beer. It's not going to wait until full. It's going to go there. It's going to clear it. It's going to pick up all of the mail. Then it's going to come back to there. Then it's going to clear. Then it's going to come home. <laughs> Bit of a weird system in place there, but it is what it is. Um, Hamburg, we can... I think we're going to connect it. Yeah, I think we will. We'll connect it to Berlin. And weirdly, we're sort of just we're going around um, around a lot of these places. I didn't expect to do that. Uh, Leipzig furniture plant. Well, I'd like to bid on that. I don't have the money. Oh, I do now. Basically, I want to drive the price up. I'm not paying in more than 150 for it. But we've got it for a steal at 115. Perfect. Uh, let's keep buying buying some stock, I think. Not able to get stock? No. Tell you what, let's just continue on building. So we're in Leipzig here. I thought it was Berlin, actually, but it did not. And this way we'll have ooh, probably that to there. That to there. And from here, we want passengers and mail. And we are 
sort of handicapping ourselves just somewhat by the limitation of the challenge. Ooh. Straight into Dresden. Same thing. Run into there. Fairly busy around here, isn't it? Oh no, oh no, oh yeah, right, that's that's broke. Uh, that's not going to fix. Oh, it's, even, it's getting worse. Oh, it's getting worse. Right, well, there's no way we're fixing that. Um, ooh, 25% passenger delivery bonus. That is the Pullman's Palace car. We'll have a cheeky bit on that. While we're buying out other people's stock. Our next stock is a mill. I think we've got that, which is good. Uh, right, so for that, we want to upgrade that to a terminal. We want to get another loco. Passengers and mill. The problem is we haven't got that thing that goes across now. So we have to do that. It's done it again. And I don't think I can select it. It's like right in between there. That's a problem when you've got... Well, quite frankly, an ancient game. But we can't I can't fix that. Right, that's just right, yep, yeah, that's that's a problem um not for us. We're gonna go over here. Uh, <laughs> how are we doing here? Oh, we're doing pretty well. Uh, let's have a quick look at the report here. Uh, we're leading on f mail, food, beer, automobiles, swine, steel, paper. We're second for grain and passengers and manufactured goods uh, and passengers and wood, Helmuth. But not the paper mill. We can use this paper mill, can't we? It was paper from there. Right, how are we going to get to there? Um, come off the back of Munich, really. So, up to there. That goes in there. We're going to snake around the mountain to burn. Then we're going to come down Turin. Ooh. Auto investments bring about surprising yields. <laughs> Deliver 50 carloads of automobiles. That need completed by the 1980s. We've completed in 1879. <laughs> 101 years before we were supposed to do it. Brilliant. And there's the 440 Class S3. Excellent. So, all of the wood, wait until full. Go there, clear, fill up on, sorry, clear, fill up on paper, go down there, clear, eventually passengers and mail, but it's, that's an eventual thing. Station, then a terminal. There we go. Right, uh, furniture frenzy spreads across the region. Fair enough. So, we are able to buy out some more stocks. I think we're just going to start buying out stocks now. How are we doing for stocks in general? Well, we are leading on 26,000. Next is Helmuth on 12,000. So it's still respectable. Nicholas the second on just six there. So they're half again on oh, Bismarck. What a shame. Couldn't have happened to a nicer AI. Uh, they're not doing anything. I'm tempted to head to Berlin just to get maybe achievements so spin around like that and then do that and then there's Germans love the new flying hamburger line which I think we need to complete early uh, sorry not that one. Oh, a new speed record <laughs> it's literally coming off the rails we can see at the bottom there uh, that's pretty good 40 odd miles an hour oh no we have got the hamburger, flying hamburger line that's good uh, right, so we now own 60% of Helmuth, and Nicholas is also up for the for the buying. Hang on. This is not being exploited. No, it is being exploited. I was going to say, how is that not being exploited? So this is where we can go around and see what's making what in terms of money, and we can start buying out things like the brewery, because the brewery is making decent money. In fact, there's a... Prague paper mill here, which we're going to buy out. Don't even know if we want it, 
but we're going to buy it out. Speaking of buying out, we should have bought out. Oh, increase speed in tight turns. That's a Westinghouse Airbrex patent. Let's keep putting bids in. I'm also going to put that paper mill on the go. And also put that newspaper on the go. Looks like we're going to get this. There it is. And let's see what we can get here. I'm fairly confident we can get it. With all of our money coming in. I'm going to pay a pretty penny for it though. Over quarter of a million. Over quarter of a million. There it is. And now there's the newspaper. Which, ironically, is only only being distributed locally because we don't have a train leaving there with any passengers or mail or anything like that. Already the paper mill, uh, the, the newspaper's over a quarter of a million. But we've got it. We've got it. Alright, is there any industries that are not being exploited? Um, let's check in the corner here. Um, I mean, Paulson's not really doing much, industry-wise. That's being exploited. That's been... Yeah, this is fairly empty over on that side. This is our um, mainstay, though. Just lots and lots of... Uh, lots and lots of money there. Let's upgrade this loco. It says preferred passenger, but... To be fair, it is preferred. Passengers and mail, I think. Mail and passenger, yeah. Anything passengers and mail, we're going to upgrade to the new new loco. Mm -hmm. I have to be careful because one of these coming back is uh, not, not just passengers and mail, it changes a couple of times. That power plant's making money. Let's buy that out. Shame these can't really do anything. We went under Luxembourg. We literally tunneled underneath. Um, let's make sure we get that. Just waiting for the swine farms to pay up. We'll get that upgraded. Much quicker as well. So, in terms of industry, where are we at now? We now lead on passengers, mail, food, beer, automobiles, swine, coal, p paper, and steel. Uh, only grain, which we don't, uh, which is Nicholas, and manufactured goods and wood for Helmuth. And you would expect that anyway, considering, well, if he's transporting the most wood, surely he'd be transporting the most goods, because that's what you'd use after it. And he's got, has he got gold trains? Yes, I believe he has gold trains. <laughs> bit vulgar. Vice is a bit hilly, but working. And, I mean, we could go around and build some more, but frankly... Ooh, get that steel mill. It's expensive. I'm actually hoping... Now that I've done that, I'm hoping someone else buys it. I don't think they're going to, though. But we'll get it for a steal. There it is. Okay, so... Um, we are leading easily on 37,000. This is a done This is a done deal, basically. Unless they've got loads of money in the pocket to buy us out in one go, we've got this one done. Um, so, we need to buy out Helmuth and Nicholas the second. We... Even though... We're on 37,000. The next highest is Helmuth on 17, followed by Nicholas. So, yeah. Basically, there's ourselves, half that Helmuth, half that again, Nicholas. So you'd think Nicholas would be the easy one to buy out, but they're, they have uh, 13,000. Sorry, 13 million to buy out, and we only have six. But we can buy Helmuth out, even though they're worth a lot more, for eight. Because we own... 60% of them, as opposed to 20% of Nicholas. 
So we'll buy out Helmuth. We'll actually inadvertently gain two sets of stock anyway, so we'll have 40% of Nicholas. So that's pretty much an easy ride. Well, look at all the paper that's there. That's not being transported anywhere. We're not even in Prague, are we? Half's cost to build bridges. Not, not a concern. Um... I mean, we are in Dresden. We can get over to Prague. You know what we could do? This is really cheeky, but, um, well. We build that. We then build from here. Up and over. Into Prague, like so. And we build... A... Newspaper. <laughs> and now we can transport... All of that to there, clear it, bring back manufactured goods for all I care. And now we're going to be transporting paper. And now we own the paper mill, because we bought that out earlier, and we own because we bought out, well, we actually built, for half a million I may add, the newspaper. But that's going to pay back very quickly. Um, speaking of payback, we are going to get some, because... We can now buy out Helmuth. Liquidate or merge? I am going to merge. Normally I would liquidate, but part of our supply lines, we are taking stuff from them. So we're best off. We're best off, uh, yeah, doing that. Oh, the 460P8. Night train. And. Frankly, the money that's coming in is ridiculous. Let's see what we are now. <laughs> it still says manufactured goods, Helmuth. Well, they don't exist anymore. It might be because we've merged it and he's still on that list. I'm not too sure. Um, the price of cars. Look at the price of cars. It started at 50 grand. I think cars are the most expensive thing in the game. Actually, gold might be. Munitions are quite expensive as well. But anyway, certainly on this map, cars are the most expensive. And then up to 61,000. What has dropped, though, is passengers. Went from about 18,000 to 4,000 by the look of it. And mail's dropped as well. What has gone up, though, manufactured goods. You get different events and stuff. It's all based on supply and demand and time scale. Uh, and that popped up on the top left there and said, This train has been immobile for quite some time. Yeah, let's buy this brewery out then. Make all of the problems go away by buying out that brewery. <laughs> uh, double brewery. Double brewery. Let's get that bought. One of the things we've done previously, and it was quite a fun thing doing it, is uh, we did the no industry challenge where we wouldn't buy industry. But what happened was... I think we failed it the first time. Second time we attempted it, we got to a point where we had enough money to ooh, increase freight pulling power for all trains. Let's get that. Yeah, we we had enough money uh, to buy someone out, and the person we bought out had about six or seven industries. And immediately, <laughs> it's just so they've spent all the money. Um, I don't think the AI builds industries, but certainly they've spent all this money buying out these industries um, and whatnot. Swarms of psycho piggies flooding the Rhine. Crazy swine escape. Shakes public demand. Escapade of swines, eh? Uh, yeah, so we bought them out and got, got all this industry. Anyway, we are going to win for 230,000. That's increased pulling power for all trains. Again, we could go through and upgrade all of these, but it's probably going to cost, I would guess, a million to do them all. And I mean, there is a lot of trains but we've already got 6.3 million by the time we get to the right amount of money probably 11 million we're over halfway there to buying out Nicholas Nicholas is doing well on the grain which is interesting because we are transporting most of the beer because yeah the grains it's an intermediate one it's grain to beer beer to end destination so they're bringing the grain in, but there we're taking the beer out. And then we own, normally the brewery anywhere. Um, I don't think there's anything else we need to buy, really. 
That's a weird shape, isn't it? <laughs> hmm. It's, um, try. <laughs> like a rhombus Vienna. It's like, yeah, it's like diamond shaped. But the, the fact that the track goes directly in. <laughs> How weird. How weird. And there's all of the cars. Lots of cars. Transporting through. That's a lot of train as well. Going through there. Brilliant. So yeah, as estimated, they have just ticked over 11 million. And frankly, I started this sentence just under 10 million. Yeah. Less than 30 seconds. And well, we're able to buy them out. And there we go. That is both... Nicholas and Helmut bought out. Otto didn't really have a chance. Oh, what a shame. Never mind. I may get to sleep at some point tonight. There you go. That has been a bit of Railroads. Nice little palate cleanser. I like getting back on Railroads. It's a chill game. It's fun, interesting. And, well, if you want to see more, by all means, let me know. If you have any tips or suggestions, comments, etc. for uh, the builds we've just undertaken here. What you think we should have done different. But mainly as well, what challenges do you think we can do? What maps you would like to see? Let me know in the comments. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.